You can find just about anything at this weekend's Central Kentucky Home and Garden Show. Big claim. Big stuff out there. Lee Cruz is joining us from the Lexington Center with a preview. We'll say good morning. Hey, good morning, guys. Uh, today we're broadcasting from the Lexington Center. This is home for the Home and Garden Show, and we've got with us the guy running the farmer's market out of Lexington. This is Josh. Good to see you, buddy. How are you? Good morning. It's great to be here. You guys are set up here. Oh, yeah. We're, we're set up here, um, and we're excited to be here at the Home and Garden Show um, and, and sharing all we have for the beginning of spring. This seems like a perfect fit. I don't know why we haven't done this sooner, actually. You know? um, we've been doing this as part of the Home and Garden Show for the last few years, but this year it's bigger and better than ever before. Well, it, it seems like it because you got all the participants that you normally have, like mm -hmm. we're in front of three toads here. They, so you can come sample things and get to experience everything you would say at a normal farmer's market? Uh, almost everything except the fruits and some of the vegetables, yeah, but we have some beautiful oriental lilies here. You can get the fresh cut flowers or you can get some of the bulbs. We have farmers with jams and jellies and honey and olive oil and teas, um, even some breads. If you don't want to cook breakfast or tomorrow morning, you can stop by, grab some stuff and uh, have your weekend taken care of. All right, so now today, tomorrow, you guys are here and I know you want to tell people that uh, you can help out God's Pantry too, right? That's right. If you bring some cans, you can get a discount on your amends to the, the Home and Garden Show. So um, that helps us, helps the people in, of Central Kentucky, and helps you save a few dollars. Right, now, this is just one of the many things and attributes that are part of the Home and Garden Show. Now, if you want to do some decorative items, you can go over and see our next friend. We'll do that in a minute. Josh, thank you, buddy. Thank you very much. Follow me. So let's go see our friend Tom Kaywood over here at uh, Lexington Outdoor Lights. Good to see you there, Good to Tom. see you, Lee. You, I'm doing great. Doing great. I, we've talked before. You know I'm a big fan of what you guys do because it is so important to have curb appeal, whether you're selling the home or not, just to look exactly. good. It There's looks no great. better way to do it than sort of theatrical lighting. Well, right? And you enjoy, your, you enjoy your outside so much longer. You know, when the sun goes down, you can go outside, you've got great lighting in your garden or on your deck. It adds a lot of security. It adds right. a lot of uh, safety to the home. Um, and that's always a good thing. You, you can't be too safe and you can't be too secure. I know it's a busy time for you, but I mean, what essentially you could do is get a consultation set Absolutely. up? Absolutely. It doesn't cost anything. It's no obligation, no cost. We come out at night. We set up an evening demonstration. You get to see what your home looks like illuminated. And then you make the decision on where you want lights placed, how you want trees featured or walkways illuminated. And then we kind of go from there and work with you on the overall design. Website, people can go and see photos of past work? Absolutely. You know? Lexington.outdoorlights.com. All right. There. There it is. Again, one of the stops here at the Home and Garden Show you can come see this weekend, today or tomorrow, as uh, Tom will be more than happy to talk with you. Good to see you, buddy. Good to see you, Lee. Thanks so much. Yeah. That'll do it from here, guys. Back to you. Yeah, lots out there. Lots of stuff to I do. I some of those snacks. Yes. I love good olive oil. All right. <laughs> Still ahead.